The annual Bark in the Park event is set to take place in Alliance on September 10 from 12 to 4 p.m. The event will be hosted at the Coastal Pet Bernal Dog Park, located at 2025 West State Street in Alliance, Ohio. Headlining the event will be the performance show Dogs of Ohio, a captivating dog performance group based in Columbus. They will showcase their talents with two shows scheduled at 1.30 and 3 p.m. These performances promise an array of acrobatic tricks, stunts, and frisbee catching displays. This family-friendly event is open to all ages and is free of charge. Attendees are encouraged to bring their leashed, furry companions. Additionally, the event will mark the opening of a special space designed for pet owners to remember and mourn their beloved animals. Harry Pidas, the president of the City of Alliance Parks and Recreation Department's Board of Directors, expressed optimism about the event's attendance, anticipating a pleasant turnout. The performance dogs of Ohio, hailing from Columbus, are well known for their captivating shows featuring seven or eight dogs performing remarkable agility tricks, stunts, and frisbee catching feats. These performances are renowned for their family-friendly entertainment value. Wesley Ryan, the executive director of the Performance Dogs of Ohio, highlighted the group's commitment to engaging the audience by involving them in the show. The troupe is dedicated to showcasing some of the nation's finest frisbee, stunt, disc, trick, and agility dogs. The group's impressive resume includes halftime performances during college and professional football games, as well as appearances at various entertainment events and festivals. Notably, they participated in the halftime show for a USFL game between the Houston Gamblers and Pittsburgh Maulers at Tom Benson Hall of Fame Stadium in Canton. Ryan described the group's shows, beginning with a thrilling freestyle flying disc display where dogs jump off performers' backs to catch frisbees. The diverse group of performers includes Australian Shepherds, Border Collies, and Corgis. Moreover, the group actively promotes the adoption of rescue dogs. Alongside the performance dogs shows, the Bark in the Park event will feature various other attractions, including a 15-minute doggy parade commencing at noon. This parade will route from the dog park, around the Coles Plaza, and back to the park. The Alliance Police Department will contribute to the event with a police canine demonstration scheduled for 1 p.m. and 2.30 p.m. In addition to these activities, attendees can expect therapy dogs, opportunities to create keepsake pet paw plagues, valuable training tips, children's activities, a doggy kissing photo booth, raffle prizes, and a basket auction. Food trucks and beverages will also be available for purchase. Most notably, the event will mark the inauguration of the new Pawprint Park, situated adjacent to the dog park. This space is intended for individuals to commemorate their departed pets in a serene, wooded setting. It is important to note that Pawprint Park is not a cemetery but a peaceful place for reflection. Attendees are invited to bring their dogs' collars and tags to hang on the fence as a forget-me-not memorial.